everybody has their trade. Each demon teaches a specific type of thing. The arts and the sciences and all that shit. So, the thing is that, you know, people like demon, uh, uh, exorcisms are on the rise and shit. The fact that this is even out there, it's all fake. I mean, I, we've got tons of videos showing it. It's a, these are, it's like a mass hysteria craze. Some that the, the church is clearly pushing because they want you in fear of this devil character is telling you, look, you need to make an atonement for your filthy soul. Jesus, if Jesus had made an atonement for your filthy soul, you wouldn't be a fucking slave. They wouldn't be, you wouldn't be bought a slave, sold in the stock market. But to be a, a baptized soul means you register your children with the church. They're own you. You're a fucking, yeah, they'll never get it. People, and you can say, oh, we collapse this and do that. You know, listen, when you collapse the CQV trust, there's no value in it. And if you think, oh, now you're a freeman on the land or something like this, look around you. You're still paying for your fucking air. Everybody around you that you have to support. And you say, well, I don't know if you live in the fucking trees over there. In a fucking dumpster, I'm off the grid. So I'm like, look, there's, what I'm saying is that people, you, you're not, you haven't done anything, but you're all alone. Now you're one person all alone. You're missing the whole, right? You, if you free one person, you got to free them all. And if you say you pulled off something like you did this and that, look, I've been through this shit and I'm telling you, it's just all a funny loop. It's a joke. It's that you need to unite peacefully and take back your universe. Not that you want to take back a trust with millions or a billion dollars in there. That's a joke. You want to take back your fucking world. Yeah. Not a bunch of worthless fucking paper. That's a bunch of numbers in a computer that's owned by banksters and shit. You're, you become so filthy retarded when you... When people talk shit with me, like, we've done this, we've done that, and now we're this and now we're that. You ain't done shit. You ain't going anywhere. Mm -hmm. You ain't done shit. I'm telling you as a devil. You ain't done shit. Because now look around. Your mom, your dad, your children, everybody else, are they going to believe you? They don't even want to believe that they're fucking bonded slaves. And how are you going to tell them that they're not monkeys floating in a ball? I mean, you've got a lot of fucking catching up to do. They even say you, you've done it. Oh, my God. Let me tell you what, I've been standing here as a devil on gallons of blood putting this information out there for a few years now. I don't care what anybody says about me. You're all fucking dead without me. You know, I, I, I can actually see it. So, you know, when people say I'm a sovereign, that's type of funny type shit. You're a sovereign. That's funny. Don't tell them you're a fucking sovereign. Watch how fast that motherfucker beats you ass up. I'm making sure you should have. Uh, they're already prepared for talk stupid shit let's very specific words have to be said and done and all kinds of shit and nobody's nobody's in that position of the mental state to pull us off you'd have to be like literally the devil himself trying to take over the universe uh flying your colors clear you know a pirate can pirate the high seas and take your shit and you knew he was coming because you knew what that pirate flag was way, way over there. Did you not? Mm -hmm. Knew that motherfucker. And I'm telling you, devil, you know, have a shelf in the house of my eyes. So when you think you're a creator, there's a shelf set up for the devil because it's like, I am the seal of death. Thankfully, says my eyes.